Alright, in this lecture we're gonna create our first button. So go to Xcode and click on main.storyboard. Once you're there, make sure you have this view selected, okay? So the, the right panel should be shown. Once you are there, I want you to click on the object library and on the search, I want you to search for button, B-U-T-T-O-N. All right, there's going to be a bunch of them and you just have to select the first one, which is the regular button. It intercepts touch events and it sends an action message to a target object when it's tapped. Okay, so I want you to just drag and drop this button inside of the view right here. Okay, now you can just put it anywhere. I'm just going to put it in the top left corner right here just for the sake of it. Okay, and it appears right there. Again, you can play with the edges to make the button bigger or smaller okay and right here if you go to the attributes you can play again with the same attributes as the one for a label by changing the test the, the text let's say press me okay so as you can see press enter it says press me now i'm going to change the text color to an a different color i'm going to take a greenish color okay all right and um, i'm going to take a different background color instead of having a white background color i'm gonna go to other and pick a reddish background color oh i'm sorry i i did not uh, select the button so i just selected the view so select the button okay and again right here if you go down you will see the background right here okay in the attributes and change that to another color other and i'm gonna pick a reddish color Okay, it's not that great looking, but it's just for the sake of seeing what it does. All right, that will do. Okay, so now I want you to click on run, on the, that play button right here, or just product, build, okay? And, and then you can do run, okay? But just the, the play button does the exact same thing. All right, now it's about to launch in the simulator. And as you can see, we have the press me button. So I'm gonna click it. And as you can see, we see the color that's getting dimmed because it's getting pressed, okay? But obviously nothing happens because we have made no connection. We have not stated what's supposed to happen whenever we press it, right? But at least we have our very first button that is showing in the iPhone simulator device. Congratulations. Let's move to the next lecture and do something interesting with that.